It's a way for artists to solidify their presence on YouTube as a music creator. It also opens up some new features and optimization functions for your channel to help with discoverability and being able to connect with your fans. What's going on guys? Adam Ivey, sellmusic.com, here to help you go further faster in your music career by sharing proven marketing techniques and strategies to help transform that passion for making music and turn it into a legitimate business that's gonna provide you with freedom and fulfillment, two of the most important things in life in general. Now, you guys already know, but YouTube is easily one of my favorite platforms to grow a brand and a business. And one of the things that a lot of you guys have been asking me about is Adam, how do I get an official artist channel on YouTube? Now, if you're unfamiliar with what an official artist channel is, I'll have a link in the description box below where you can go check that out after this video and get a full breakdown directly from YouTube so that you have a full understanding of what it is. But in short, it's a way for artists to solidify their presence on YouTube as a music creator. It also opens up some new features and optimization functions for your channel to help with discoverability and being able to connect with your fans. So with that being said, it's super easy to do with the help of my favorite distribution service, DistroKid. I've actually had some of my own students go through the manual steps of applying for an official artist channel directly through YouTube, which is a bit of a pain and kind of a slow process. Uh, well, not anymore. Thanks to DistroKid, the process is incredibly quick and easy. And what I'm gonna do in this video is I'm gonna break down the six steps of going through this and doing this, claiming your own channel with DistroKid um, with and without having a new release to post because the processes are slightly different. Now, feel free to pause this video uh, as you follow each step. And first, like I said, I'm gonna go over option one, which is how to claim your YouTube official artist channel with having a new release ready. And if you don't have a DistroKid account already, it's no big deal. Um, you could sign up for the lowest possible rate ever over at distrodiscount.com, which is gonna get you set up for less than $2 per month or like five cents a day if you break it down like that, which uh, I'm pretty confident that the majority of you can afford when it comes to investing in your music career. Anyway, uh, here are the steps with the new release. So step one is making sure that you already have a channel dedicated to your content as an artist on YouTube. If not, please create one and name it after your artist name. Step number two is starting a new release via DistroKid. Step three, make sure you select Google Play and YouTube Music as a store. Step number four, the new release upload form should have an option for you to authenticate your YouTube account. Step five, after that, if your channel contains your artist name, you should be able to select it. Step six, when your release is approved, it'll be sent to YouTube with your official artist channel request. And that's all you have to do if you have a new release ready as option one. But option number two is claiming your YouTube official artist channel without having a new release ready, which is very similar, but these are those exact steps. All right, guys, so just like in option one, make sure that you already have a channel dedicated to your content as an artist on YouTube. And if you don't, please create one and name it after your artist's name. Now, step number two is making sure the artist has at least one release that has selected Google Play YouTube as a store. Now, step number three is going to the YouTube official artist channel section of your DistroKid account. Click the more menu, then go to streaming service goodies. Step four, select the artist you want to associate with your YouTube channel. Step five, authenticate into your YouTube account. Step six, claim your channel. And that's it, I told you it was super easy. Now, in case you were wondering why I don't have that fancy little music note next to my name here on YouTube, it's because I'm a producer and even though I'm still gonna be releasing some music here on the channel very soon, uh, I use this channel as an educational resource for you guys, so I wouldn't wanna misclassify it as an official artist channel. And a quick side note, directly from YouTube, if you're getting started and you don't have at least three official releases on YouTube through a distribution partner such as DistroKid, you probably won't get approved for an OAC, an official artist channel. Now, YouTube might loosen up on those requirements, so it's still worth a shot, but down the road, uh, you can check that out and continue to check back and try. But right now, that's their policy. Now, just one more reason for you to get up and get on DistroKid and get those releases going. Again, distrodiscount.com if you haven't already. Now, I wanna know in the comments below if you already have an official artist channel here on YouTube, let me know. If you're going to be applying for one, let me know. And before you go, I want you to click this video so you can understand why I'm so passionate about promoting DistroKid. And if you haven't yet, I invite you to join the channel family by clicking that little subscribe button and smashing that bell icon so you can be notified first anytime I upload a video just like this. I'd love for you to come connect with me over on Instagram. And until next time, I appreciate you watching.